Hey everybody, welcome to my YouTube channel. Flashback with me, if you will, to the summer of 1990. Now, CBS had launched a new show that summer on Monday nights called Northern Exposure. The show would become a surprise hit for the network and would last for six seasons. And while the show's main stars were great, I truly believe that the supporting cast was a big reason for the overall success of the show. In this video, I'm going to discuss Elaine Miles, who played Sicily resident Marilyn Whirlwind throughout the show's entire run. Now, interestingly enough, I've read that Elaine Miles didn't actually intend on auditioning for a role in Northern Exposure, but was instead accompanying her mother, who was auditioning for the role. Apparently, the process of the auditions was taking some time and Elaine was getting a little grumpy and making that known to her mother. The two were bantering back and forth in their native language and the show's creators noticed the interaction between the two and asked her to audition as well. Now ultimately, Elaine would be cast as Marilyn Whirlwind and her mother was cast as Marilyn's mother. How perfect was that? Elaine Miles would appear in all six seasons spanning 110 episodes of Northern Exposure from 1990 through 1995. In 1998, Elaine Miles would appear in the film Smoke Signals, which was the first film to be written, directed, and co-produced by American Indians. Now, as a side note, in 2018, the United States Library of Congress selected Smoke Signals for preservation in the National Film Registry. In 2007, she would appear in the film Tortilla Heaven, a comedy about an amazing restaurant in a small Mexican town that is struggling financially until a miracle happens. The face of Jesus appears on one of their tortillas. In addition to acting, Elaine occasionally takes to the stage either as an MC for various events or to showcase her skills with stand-up comedy. Another project she got involved with was an exercise video she made with fellow comedian Drew LaCapa. Now the goal of that video, which was called Resrobics, was to help address diabetes rates among Native Americans. The video combines dancing, martial arts, and aerobics moves with nutritional advice. In contrast to the usual FBI warning, the creators encouraged people to copy the video freely and distributed among friends and relatives in what they refer to as Indian Country. What a great cause! In the year 2015, she was in the independent film Fishing Naked, a romantic comedy about four young adults who get in trouble for pulling off a hoax about Bigfoot. In early 2021, Elaine would unfortunately become ill from COVID-19 and ended up being hospitalized. Her recovery has been rough but according to her Facebook fan page, she is gradually recovering and getting better every day. Now interestingly enough, as recent as 2018, CBS had been discussing a revival of Northern Exposure, and if that ever came to fruition, I would hope that Elaine Miles would once again be cast as Marilyn Whirlwind. Now here's a fun picture of Elaine from the early days of Northern Exposure with co-stars Rob Morrow and Janine Turner. What a great show that was, and it had such a great cast. In my opinion, one of the best aspects of Northern Exposure were all the supporting characters such as Elaine's. They really brought the town of Sicily, Alaska to life. Now I hope you enjoyed this update on the whereabouts of Elaine Miles. I look forward to reading your comments. Also, I would greatly appreciate it if you would consider subscribing to my channel, where I talk about the movies, music, and TV shows that I loved while growing up in the 70s, 80s, and 90s. Thank you so much for watching, stay safe out there, and have a great day.